Let's see another numerical problem in the series of problems that we are studying. A previous year board examination problem again says show that surface area of a closed cuboid with a square base given volume is minimum when it is a cube. Now for these type of questions you must know what are cubes, what are cuboids. Now it is given to us that it is a cuboid into consideration but the cuboid has a square base. Let's actually revise the formulas of volume and surface area in case of cuboid. Volume was L into B into H. Surface area was twice multiply LB plus BH plus HL. And now you already know that square base is given to you. So when square base is given to you, definitely two of its sides are equal. So if L and B are equal and they are equal to X, if H is equal to Y, you know what I'm talking about. I have to say my volume my volume and my surface area are what let's see my volume would be equal to l into b into h which is x into x into y my surface area would be equal to twice into lb plus bh plus hl it is again yx i'm sorry so it is yx or xy only or otherwise sa is equal to what which is equal to s only i can write like that twice multiplied by x square plus 2xy and volume is say v equation number one equation number two now given to me is given volume is minimum and it is talking to show about the surface area to show about the surface area means you have to differentiate s differentiating s means you need only x and x and not y so let me find out the value of y and put here so it is twice x square plus 4x and multiply by y is v upon x square and where is this from it is nothing but from 1 from 1 now things cancel x cancels with x it is s is equal to 2x square plus 4v upon x now what I can do is if this is my equation number 3 I know that I need to differentiate surface area so finding ds by dx which is equal to 4x plus 4v and 1 upon x differentiation is minus 1 upon x square it is equal to 4x minus 4v upon x square and that is equal to your ds by dx but in order to prove something we have to put the first derivative equal to 0 so put ds by dx is equal to 0. Now you see as soon as we are going towards more number of questions the questions are becoming more clear to you and these questions are definitely going to come in 4 or 6 marks. One of these questions would be coming in 6 marks a question of this kind so please keep practice of it. So it is 4x is equal to 4v upon x square 4 4 getting cancelled I get volume is equal to x cube. This is your equation number 4. But when you compare 4 with 1, compare 1 equation with 4th equation, it is nothing but x square y, it is x cube. So x cube is equal to x square y or in short I have x is equal to y. That means the square base it is talking about, x and y are equal. x and y are equal means x cube is the volume means it is a cube. So here only I have proved that all the edges are equal so it is a cube. But have I proved about given volume minimum? No. For given volume minimum I need to differentiate second time ds by dx so it becomes d2s by dx square where is ds by dx it is here. So it is 4 from here minus 4v is there. What is the differentiation of x raised to the power minus 2? It is nothing but minus 2 x raised to the power minus 3 which is equal to 4, right? And 4 2s are makes it 8 v upon x cube. Now what is the value of v? v is definitely from 4, from 4, v is equal to x cube so it is 4 8 x cube upon x cube cancelling whatever cancels so it is 12 which is greater than 0 is the value of second derivative value of second derivative 
and second derivative is coming out to be 12 which is greater than 0 so it has to be minima so that means we have proved both the things that cube should be there minimum area should be there minimum surface area should be there and that is how we are going to do these kind of questions